Sterilization of stray dogs is a big part of what we do in our clinic here at People Farm, but we're often asked, why should we sterilize stray dogs? The argument against sterilization usually begins with, but doesn't sterilization go against nature? Doesn't it prevent dogs from living their natural lives where they get pregnant and give birth to puppies? This argument stems from what's called the naturalistic fallacy. It's based on the assumption that just because something is natural means that it's universally right. But there is no rule that says that this is true. In fact, hardly anyone lives their lives according to that assumption. If that were true, then the creation of dogs, a domesticated species, would go against the very basis of that argument. Dogs were created about 15,000 years ago, and we directed their evolution away from what nature's pressures would be to make them act and look the way we wanted them to. If we tried to return a domesticated dog to nature, almost no dog could survive in complete isolation in the jungle without humans. Even stray dogs who don't have feeders rely on the waste and scraps from human civilization in order to survive. Sterilization has many benefits to dogs. Firstly, sterilization is beneficial for their health. Sterilization reduces the risk of certain types of cancers, especially ovarian and breast cancers. It also helps moderate the hormones for both male and female dogs and makes them more emotionally even keeled. These benefits apply to pet dogs as well, who also suffer from hormonal mood swings. Males are more aggressive when unsterilized and can mark more around the house and yard. Females will be more aggressive during their heat and walking them during this time with other stray dogs around can be quite dangerous. It can also be difficult for pet owners during a female's heat cycle. They either have to force her to wear diapers or clean up blood stains all over the house. Sterilization prevents this. Pregnancy is very trying and risky for stray females. Often by the end of pregnancy, birth and weaning, stray females are completely emaciated and the vitamins have all been leached out of their bodies. Second, sterilization prevents a lot of emotional pain for stray dogs as well. Female stray dogs are hounded by males when they come into heat. The males chase them and often force them to mate multiple times every heat cycle. When a female stray dog gives birth, she's under immense pressure to both feed and protect her puppies. More than 95% of puppies die before they're one year old. So even after all of this stress and pain, the female dog still has to endure watching her puppies succumb to disease or come under cars. Being a stray mother is not joyful or beautiful. It's wrought with grief and pain. Sterilization acts as a preventative rescue and prevents the deaths of all those puppies that would have been born. Lastly, if your pet dog does get pregnant, not only do you have to find good homes for all of those puppies, those puppies take homes which could have been given to a stray puppy who will now suffer and die on the street. So whether the dog in question is your pet or a group of strays in your neighborhood, the kindest thing to do is to sterilize. Contact your local animal rescue or veterinary hospital to learn more about sterilization today. Many people say why don't you put these videos on YouTube? So we have made our YouTube channel. The link is youtube.com slash peoplefarm.